Hello and welcome to Net 101. What I'd like to talk about today is receiving a proposal for a new website build and looking at some of the elements. Um, it makes a lot of sense to try and chunk a proposal down into the different components rather than just look at, uh, at it as a whole in the um, large number, hopefully not large number, um, on the back page. Um, break it down into different components such as the content management system, uh, SEO, uh, design, um, content, and if they're going to do any work around the peripheral of the website, which is say, uh, setting up social media platforms for you. I'll look at one aspect today, and um, it seems to be fairly common amongst proposals to throw search engine optimization as a part of the package, or it could be a line item, and it could cost anywhere from a couple of hundred to a couple of thousand dollars to SEO the site, whatever that means, come back to that shortly. Um, and Typically, and this is uh, what I find a little bit disturbing, are uh, maintenance packages for search engine optimization. So let's just take a, a step back. A website really is only as good as the content within it, and to the most part we're talking textual content. That's what the search engine spiders, crawlers pick up and put in the databases. When we search engine optimize a site, what we're really doing is trying to align your content logically in the way that people would search for it uh, when they go to a, a search engine. So to have a consultant to come in and, and search engine uh, optimize your site for you um, doesn't make a whole lot of sense because it really comes back to your ability to produce good quality content, but importantly have that content be found by the target audiences. So when we talk about SEO, we're talking about good content on a page, a good strong uh, heading of the page, very important for SEO, that uh, the most important keywords are sitting within that heading and on the meta title. We don't worry about keywords, um, meta keywords, we certainly don't play games like trying to stuff keywords uh, in places that can't be seen by the search engines. White on white uh, is one of the, the, the big games people used to play. So we don't actually need somebody to help us through that process. You know, five or ten minutes, bring yourself up to speed, go to Google and download the Google SEO starter guide more than enough for you, but your job is to start producing the content. Now the agency or the consultant can't produce content or really shouldn't be producing content on your behalf. That's your job. Your website is a container. You must fill it with quality content. Now maintenance, what on earth is all that about? So my question to anyone putting out a proposal to maintain SEO for you would be what are you doing for the money? You're not creating the content. The content has been crawled and put at the data centers. Um, we don't pay Google the privilege uh, to do that and have us hopefully turn up in search results. It just sits in the data centers forever. Now some people will say, well, look, we're providing backlinks for you. Well, that's largely discredited these days. To try and manufacture backlinks to get your site more credible um, is really frowned upon. Google and all the major search engines want you to build up credibility naturally, and that comes from having quality content. So what are they actually doing? Even if they were to go out and find backlinks for you, I very much doubt on a monthly basis for the couple of hundred dollars or a couple of thousand dollars in some cases I've seen some companies ask for, that they're actually doing anything. Okay? So cross out maintenance for SEO. In fact, I'll cross out SEO altogether. You do need to know some of the basics as to how search engines work, but fundamentally, Good SEO being found on the web by the people that you're targeting comes down to quality content. And it won't happen overnight, you've got to build that up over time. There'll be more in the series. I'd like to go through uh, different proposals and break down uh, and examine some of the other components, but I think that's enough for today. Good luck.